What's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Today we are down at the new job that we just started. Our guys have been here for a few days now, probably about a week or so. They were here while me and my father were working on prefabbing all of that material that is on our trailer currently. But in one of those videos I was talking about how this project is on a dead end with a driveway up the hill and it is super tight and we have limited access for our trucks and our forklift and whatnot but we did park all of our trucks down in a neighbor's driveway who currently does not live there they allowed us to park there during this project so that is super helpful and we do have our forklift here obviously which is also super helpful if we didn't have this we would be throwing everything off the roof and the interior out into the yard and then carrying it again over to the dumpster but being down in this road you can see the elevation change and how tight it is a one lane driveway straight up to the garage and with the dumpster here there's really no room for us to park we do have one of our vans on the other side there but as you can see this project is a pretty big one the whole roof is coming off they're getting a full second floor the first floor is getting raised up to nine foot ceilings they almost have the roof completely off once they get this end actually they might be i haven't spoken to them at all about it but they might be saving that just so they have somewhere to stand while they rip the rafters off of the rest of the house but by the end of the day the whole roof is going to be off we have a couple guys working on the front entrance way over there we'll walk around the house and get over there in a second but as you can see all of the siding is ripped off some of these windows are being changed which obviously we haven't pulled out yet but we got all the siding ripped off all around the house roof on the back is ripped off this is a little slider into the back door into the staircase to the second floor which that will be getting changed as well we'll go inside in a second but you come around here this whole side is stripped the chimney will be coming down and then this is the old front entryway here which is going to be getting framed shut the front door will be getting moved into the front of the house what do you need that dumped all right let me let me dump this real quick and then we'll continue on with our little tour here
All right guys, so this whole front entryway is getting framed shut and there was quite a bit of water damage and termite damage. There was some ants living in there. So we're taking all of the rotted wood out and all of the floor beams are getting doubled up with brand new lumber. Also, obviously we have new plates all around here. And then this is gonna get framed square here and become part of the living room. The front entryway is gonna be somewhere here. I'll have to look at the plans to see exactly where it is. But it, I know it's on the, house, on the front of the house here with a new porch out here covering this mulch bed here. But as you can see inside here, everything is pretty much stripped. This is the kitchen here, which we're not currently touching. There are some minor changes that will happen down the road, but we have it all plastic off to keep it as clean as possible during the project. But everything in here got stripped. You can see there's spray foam in here, which is gonna be a bit of a pain for us to deal with. Luckily, this whole corner just gets completely taken out, but they pulled a lot of it out here. There was a wall right here. This was the master bedroom before. This was the front living room area. You come down the hall here, you have another bedroom in the back here. This is a bathroom we're not touching. And this is a little closet. I don't know if we're touching it or not, but it's taped shut. So we're gonna leave it for now. And then I believe in this room, the only thing that's happening is this window is getting replaced and then the new stairs are going to be right here i believe they go this way you go up from here i could be backwards i'll have to look at the plans but you'll have the new basement stairs and those stairs to the second floor both right there this is obviously the current basement stairs and you have the stairs to the second floor here so we're using it for now, but it is gonna be getting changed. They will be either right here up to the second floor or right here down to the basement. I don't remember exactly which direction they go, but obviously this is a pretty big project and we're gonna be here for the next probably couple months. Hopefully by the end of the day, they'll have all of the rafters off the roof and I'm gonna run in a couple minutes and grab our trailer that we have in our shop with all of that material that me and my father made the past couple days. We'll get it here, unload it, and I can bring that trailer home with me at the end of the day. And our plan is tomorrow morning to start going up on the second floor. We have the crippler walls, which we'll have to go in first to get the whole first floor up to nine feet. And then obviously from there on, it's pretty simple. But I'm gonna run and grab our trailer, get that over here, and we'll see how far we get by the end of the day.
right guys, we got all the material stacked in the front yard separated by what it is. Truck and trailer are completely empty. I'm dragging that back up. Javi's saying hi right now. Everybody leave a comment, say hi Javier. That's Javier right there in case you were wondering. But these guys got this entire roof completely ripped off. We got a little bit of cleanup up here to finish up. So we're in very good shape. These guys also got this deck down here finished and ready to be framed in. So we're in good shape here. Tomorrow morning, we're gonna start putting all the crippler walls up and whatnot and start working on this second floor. But that's gonna wrap it up for this one. If you guys have any questions or comments, definitely leave them down below and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Hope you guys enjoyed it. See you guys next time. Peace.